known as the Atari box, but um, it was officially unveiled as the Atari VCS. It's actually, what's really interesting about it is that it is crowdfunded right now. It's actually on Indiegogo, so it's like um, for $199 you can get the Atari VCS, or uh, for $299 you can get it in like um, no limited edition coloring, so it's got like, it's black, it's sleek, and it's got like a wood grain on it. I don't think it's worth an extra hundred, but whatever. It's actually, uh, in its first day, it's already reached two million dollars which is pretty amazing it actually went on pre-sale for i want to say are you why are you loading that gun anyway Pretty oh so it's actually already reached two million dollars in crowdfunding and has been a pretty uh <laughs> great start. and so i'm definitely i'm pretty excited for it so what's worth noting about the atari vcs is that it is again one hundred um, ninety nine on presale for the normal edition, two hundred ninety nine for the collector's edition, which is just a special coloring, and then the various consoles, uh, or not consoles, controllers, which are you've got that classic Atari joystick that is, I think, thirty dollars, and then um, the other one is a more traditional joystick that is I want to say fifty dollars, or I, I think it might be the same thirty. I'm not sure. Anyway. <laughs> Why are y'all loading that gun? <clears throat> so Atari hasn't re released much information about the Atari VCS, but we do know a couple things. For once, we know that it's gonna run on a modified version of the, let's make sure I'm here, Linux. There you go. Okay, yeah, Linux OS. I, I thought it was Lenovo for the longest time. Actually, like until five minutes ago. Anyway, literally until five minutes ago. Anyway, so, uh, it's going to be running a modified version of the Linux software, which a lot of people are saying that it's probably just going to be a PC. I don't think that. I was I, I was just talking to <laughs> Hey! Hey! No! No! I'm not recording! Stop! Uh -huh. You are! Uh, stop! This is abuse! Uh, yo, call someone! Help me! Help! Oh, are you recording? Yeah. Oh, okay. What's going on, guys? Setting AKA the okay, we just resume. It's, it's From where were we? Linux OS. Yeah. So a lot of people. Just see, just see where the last video ended. No, it it. Namo pina tumi kalo ice cream dedu kore si. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. I'll get you some now. Okay. So resume. Some. Can you put your phone in charging? Because if you go to Microsoft, I don't want you to be without charging the phone. Oh. I just cannot film a video. Okay, go on. Um, so a lot of people are saying that because it's oh. running a modified version of Linux, Correct. Linux. <clears throat> Say it properly. Linux. There you go. Mm. A lot of people are saying it was gonna be more of a house PC, but having seen a bit of a demo on it. It doesn't feel like that way. It definitely feels, it, it's got a more Xbox feel to it because it will be able to do uh, video as well, like YouTube and Netflix and everything. So that's gonna be really nice. It's, um, the console has been confirmed to be able to um, run older games. It, I think it ships. The, the, mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, are you guys done? Yeah, all right. The console has been, I just spit like, I don't even know what I just spit out, but I felt something coming in my mouth. The console has been confirmed to be shipping with a, new, a plethora of older Atari games, but will also be able to run newer games. Atari themselves state that they have AMD working on a graphics system uh, um, 
a custom Radeon graphics system that should be able to do 4K, 60 FPS, and HDR. Um, I think a lot of people are, a lot of people are saying, and I agree with them, that I don't think it's going to be able to do that because this is currently being sold at 200. That means when the official console actually releases, it'll be around 300, right? I mean, 250, 250 to 300, like Nintendo Switch. Can we can we shoot a video? Oh, you guys are shooting. We've been shooting a video. You interrupted us like three times. I'm sorry. I'm good. Sorry. Anybody else? Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. 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 This is my channel, and I will not tolerate. I don't care. Dad's on his way, and when he comes home, then we'll all leave for the tournament. So he'll be here in the next ten minutes. So by the way. Uh, I think you and Naman will be going to art class. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's going to be able to do that. At a $300 price tag, be able to do what, Sonia? Run 4K 60 HDR. Okay. I, I feel like that's unrealistic at a $300 <coughs> price tag. Remember, the, the Nintendo Switch had a $300, and it only runs 10K, or no. 10, 10K, 1080. 1080, sometimes down to Sometimes 60. 720 when you're using it. 720 on the handheld one. Uh, 1080 on screen. on screen. So again, I, I'll say there's a good chance it'll be able to do 1080, which is good enough for me. A lot of people might not, but I'm fine with that. Um, I just in general, I would say that I'm not completely sure. They haven't announced any specific games for it. Most of the... Um, Steam is going to work. Right, Steam is going to work on it. Most of the announcements I've seen, or not announcements, advertisements I've seen have kind of got it running the older games because, again, they don't have any confirmation on new games. Um, um, and because of that, I really... Um, I'm excited to see what kind of exclusives and stuff they're going to be lining up, but uh, hopefully another ET game. But anyway... <laughs> this is my channel! <laughs> I will not tolerate this b Anyway. Keep going. Keep going. Um, Sunny, keep going. Uh, anyway, if you guys like this video, make sure to like. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Make sure what you guys think.